in this case, we found out that uh, the ship, which was captained by a French national, um, had gone aground on the reef area. Um, since since we activated the protocol, we've been actively involved in um, a process for for getting the vessel off the reef. So we've been going out to the area since uh, since the first of January, um, and we've made several attempts to get it off the reef. We are now uh, at the point of uh, engaging the services of a of some professionals. Um, so we have a company that is not uh, doing some additional work to get the vessel off the reef by this weekend. The process, uh, according to the response protocol, the process is one first, um, ensuring safety of personnel, so human safety. So we, the first thing we did was ensure that everyone was safe. Um, secondly, it is to um, ensure safety of, um, of the environment. Um, and to do that, we have to do an assessment. However, the assessment is incomplete because we have to first get the vessel off the reef before we can complete the full assessment of the damage that has been caused. Um, the third level um, in the protocol is to then uh, protect property and so we've been trying our best to um, not interfere with the integrity of the vessel itself but we found that that has been difficult so we are now making the required adjustments in our plan to make sure that we get the vessel off. As part of Reef Week, uh, the WB Creme Wake Up Belize Morning Show is um, in Keycocker broadcasting live. So I was in Keycocker yesterday, and yes, the boat is still firmly lodged um, in, in the same spot it was um, it was moved to. Um, and yes, we're still getting concerns both from our environmental partners out there and just concerned Keycocker citizens in general, just saying we really want to, you know, see this boat removed and, and make sure that it doesn't, you know, threaten the, the live coral patches that are nearby. Um, so yes, we stand ready, willing and able to, to help make that happen because, you know, it is, it is a blight. I mean, you can, you can still see it. And um, I, I know, I think you had done some interviews that, you know, there were plans on, on going. So hopefully that happens soon.